Welcome to Kent's Vlog. Welcome to Al Megar Palace. The Al Megar Palace is located high on the Sarawat Mountains at west of Al Namas City. The palace displays a diverse set of artifacts that tells the history of the previous civilizations. The Al Megar Palace is one of the most beautiful historical buildings in the region that is sometimes known as Al Falaki or a space palace. How heavy is that? Light work the base on the track on my face. Palace has a seven domes that represents each of the world's continents. The palace is distinguished by its impressive Islamic architecture and has developed a reputation as one of the most important tourist destinations in the kingdom attracting visitors from all over the world looking to witness the beauty of this historical village and magnificence of its design The Al Megar Heritage Village is rising 2,400 meters above sea level, or equivalent to a 400-story building. The village in Al Megar Palace is the brainchild of Muhammad Al Megar. An explorer who traveled through many countries to gain wide and varied exposure in design and construction. As a result of his journeys, he was eventually able to realize his lifelong vision of constructing his eponymous village, which took more than 35 years to build and cost more than 80 million SR. The palace is also distinguished by its Islamic architecture, reflected in Andalusian drawings and Arabic and Kishani inscriptions on the walls. Impressively, the sun enters the palace from all directions through more than 360 windows that are used to track solar movement inside the building. Let's us tour the village and see the beauty of this historical palace of the region.
As you can see guys, a sharp cliff with a fog which you feel you are in the cloud nine. As you can see guys, a two-story villa, positioned on top of the rock facing a sharp cliff. Down on the palace is a viewing deck. It's a sharp cliff facing the downtown Juzan. The palace is rising 2,400 above sea level or an equivalent to a 400-story building. See guys, this is how God beautiful his creation was, and definitely how blessed this country, the Saudi Arabia is. They are blessed with the beautiful scenery, how diverse their culture was. Economically they are very rich as well. Indeed Saudi Arabia is a blessed country. As you can see guys, there was a secondary road, coming from the Al Nama city down to the proper Jizan city and vice versa. I don't think I will use that road driving going to Jizan. That's a dangerous road anyway. Muhammad al Megar used stone from the ASIR mountains to build the palace, which was designed to incorporate hanging gardens through which geometrically designed water fountains flow perfectly. The palace is also distinguished by its Islamic architecture, reflected in Andalusia. Palace seven domes representing each of the world's continents. 
the hundreds of columns representing the days of the year, and inscriptions and artistic decorations reflecting the spirit of the Umaway and Abbasid civilizations. And now, our famous jump shot of this palace. There is also a zoo and apartments overlooking the Tihama Mountains, behind the palace to serve visitors coming from remote areas. For those lovers out there, if you are looking for a romantic place, this is a perfect place for you to enjoy with. As of this date, with my adventure to the kingdom, this place is ranked number 2 on my bucket list. Next to the amazing Wadi Lajab, the amazing Grand Canyon of Saudi Arabia. Just click the link on my description box to know the beauty of Wadi La Jab. If you are new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell, so that you will be notified on my future uploaded videos. Thank you and have a nice day! Next on Kent's Vlog Please join me as I enter inside the three-story Almegar Palace and let's discover the artifact of the past civilization. The first and second floor of the palace contain more than 18,000 heritage pieces drawn from various Islamic civilizations such as Andalusia and Abbasid. 
Visitors climbing to the third floor can view historical Islamic manuscripts in medicine, astronomy, mathematics, Islamic sciences, Arabic language and Islamic schools of thought. This makes the palace a primary source for Islamic history, specifically the Holy Quran, thanks to its archive of more than 1,000 Quranic manuscripts. Mega love shout out to all my Kennedy Club member, Minions Healthy Lifestyle, Gibbs Vlog, Lands Vlog, To Vlog, Christine Vlog, Alish May Vlog, Simply Margie Tins Vlog, Nene FM, Mark Seed TV, Blair's Vlog, Nori's Vlog, Pikachu, Cheng's TV, Zonal Anola, and it's me Glendal. Maraming Salamat guys, for giving your full support on my channel. Sana Hindi KO Magbado.